Jeez Tommy, stop eating like that. It's disgusting. What? Were you raised by wolves? Now Hannah, if you want to use a fork, that's perfectly fine. But you know saying something like that is very... Honey? Where are you going? I just need a moment. I just don't get it. What are we doing wrong? Why does she hate us? She doesn't. She's just been through a lot. We have to be patient. She'll come around eventually. We try so hard to show her we care, but all we get back is content insults and disrespect. Were you raised by wolves? Seriously? It's just, it gets hard sometimes, ya yeah, know? I know. But hey, nobody ever said foster care would be easy. We knew what we were getting ourselves into. She needs us. Um, sorry kids for leaving like that. Well, imago get me some water. Wait. Don't go alone, you fool. You know the wolf is around. Yeah, he'd been picking us off all week. Oh, right, okay, who wants to go with me? I'll go with ya, yeah, buddy. Hey, you always volunteer to go with people. And they always get attacked and eaten when you're with them. So brave that you'd still volunteer after so many close calls. D, yeah, just looking out for my fellow sheep. I just hope the wolf doesn't show up. Yeah. That'd be a real shame. Yeah. A real shame indeed. Kevin? It's been a while. Yeah look different. He Janus. Yeah. Long story. First I got bitten by a vampire. Then I got bitten by a werewolf. His. Chomp. Yo. Then a radioactive spider. Then a cobra. So yeah, I kinda died. Good thing later a zombie bit me too. Oh dang. Thanks for the save dude. No, no. Wow, I was just gonna say yeah got your braces removed. Oh yeah, haha, <laughs> that too. By the way, are you gonna read that? My, my brain. We saw it in the window. It was some sort of flat-faced goblin. Just relax, Mr. Bayer. Stay here and we'll check it out. Flat-faced goblin. Can you believe that? Uh, Mark. You ever seen prints like these? Something's been digging in this porridge. And I've got back quote a broken chair over here. What the? Police. We know you're here. Come out slowly, and you won't get hurt. We have a 10 to 62, requesting backup. Whatever it is, it's been all over these beds. It's been on this bed too. And it's still here. Freeze. Don't move. Dear lord. Hey. We were supposed to go for a walk two hours ago. Yeah. What's the hold up? Sorry guys, this comic is taking longer than I thought. Well no wonder it's taking so long. It's way too detailed. You gotta make it more cartoony. I can't just change the quality mid comic. Why not? Nobody will notice, and even if they do, they won't care. Sigh, fine. It's still too detailed. Draw faster. Well, I'm pretty sure they're gonna notice. Oh yeah. Well I'm pretty sure I'm gonna freak out if we don't go on a walk soon. But it's not just the line art. I gotta color it too. It takes time. Then don't color it in genius. Go faster. Okay. Okay. I'm done. About time. Now take us for a walk fool. Wow. What a beautiful day for a while. No, people say negativity is like a monster. Snitch. A monster? Yes, and the more you feed it, the more it grows. So like, if I said, I'm too stupid to get a, a in chemistry class. Whoa, cool. 
what? No, not cool. Negativity is a bad thing. Yeah, but having a giant pet monster isn't. My nose is too big and ugly. I'll never find love. People who watch anime are losers. My friends probably don't even like me. And for dessert, if anyone disagrees with my personal world views, they're literal human trash. Awesome. I'm trying to teach you a lesson here. Who's a big cutie? You are. Yes you are. Arg. He's not even real. He's just a metaphor. I'm gonna name him Herbert. You're ruining my wholesome analogy you stupid jerk. Fifi. Well, what's her name? Cute name. Thanks. This is the end for you. Don't struggle but you can't escape. Wait, you didn't do the thing. What thing? The SSS thing. You said struggle normally. Uh, I. No way. Do you snakes do that on purpose? No. We speak that way naturally. You just messed up again. Okay listen. Yeah, we do it on purpose. It's just to be creepy and intimidating. Dude, that's kinda cringy. Shut up. I'm still gonna read you Yano. You mean still? Shut up. I thought sunlight was deadly to vampires. Oh it is, but not with this special sunscreen. SPF 5000 baby. Wait, I thought werewolves only turned in moonlight. Haha. <laughs> Dude, think about it, what exactly is moonlight? Well, the moon doesn't produce its own light. Moonlight is just reflected. Sunlight. No way. Yep, it just takes sunlight. We just say the moon thing to mess with people. Oh, by the way, I think you missed a spot. Really? Where? Wait, but wouldn't that also mean? Dang it. Well well well. Hello little red riding hood. Oh. Hello mysterious hairy stranger. What's a delicate flower like you doing out here all alone? Oh, I'm not alone, mister. What? I'm with my cousin. Humongous purple riding hood. Apparently there's some big bad wolf fella that's been preying on travelers in these woods. So, grandma insisted that cousin purple come with me. Your grandma is a smart lady. Goodness mister, what big teeth you have. Well, would you look at the time. I should really be on my way. Gotta get back to my den gap. Uh, I mean, my human house. Safe travels ladies. What a kind stranger. I do hope he doesn't run into the big bad wolf. That was the wolf you puny dumb idiot. Oh. Lol. Meh. I saw it with my own eyes. A monstrous wolf man creature. It'll attack tonight. I'm sure of it. Gasp. What are we to do? Well. I've heard that its weakness is silver. Silver? Yes, the purity of silver will ward off this impure beast. Be gone beast. Rag. Silver. My weakness. It's working. The silver worked, but what if the beast comes back? I've heard gold works even better. Gold? Really? I was right last time, wasn't I? Go away foul monster. Oh no, gold. It hurts so very bad. Spare me. Diamonds? Seriously? Yep. Super effective. With this hair sample, my hounds will track it down. And I'll shoot it dead. That's excellent, Boris. I shall call for you soon. We feel safer already. Yep. So much safer. My hounds seem drawn to you. Haha. <laughs> what can I say? I'm quite the wolf perso dog person. Hehe. <laughs> so, 
Let me get this straight. I give you a ride across the river, and in exchange, you'll give me that big juicy fish? Correcto my crocodilian compadre. So, we got a deal? Man, fair enough. Hop on. Halfway across. Up, uh, why'd we stop? Well, I just realized something. What's stopping me from just eating the fish and you right now? Up. Uh, well, uh, up, uh, nothing, I guess. Nothing except for the guilt of not keeping your word? Sigh, okay. Well, here we are. Thanks for the ride. The free ride. See ya, sucker. Hey. The heck. Yeah, thought you might do that. What's that you said about not keeping your word? Hey, I suddenly see the error of my ways. Take this fish as a sorry present.